Hello and welcome to Madhouse Militia Presents episode 123, Fun Times in the Booty Shorts Hole. Speeches calls by Snappy Bakes, Luxapal, Cat Astrophy, Dr. Unk PhD, Turbo, Big Boy Fart, 666, DTB, Dwight the Janitor Milkman, and me, Axpa. We would like to give thanks to the following people for helping make the show go, such as Dwight the Janitor. Wasted Memory for RogueServer.com, where we broadcast every Friday night at 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific. Dragomir for the Corndown at Corndown.com or RogueServer.com forward slash Dragomir at 7 p.m. on Fridays Eastern and 4 p.m. Pacific. Boy, that's a mouthful. We'd also like to give thanks to our patrons such as Ryan T., Carlos T., Flusritz, Experts, Brian N., Big Chungus, Jayad, Travis B, Gold Rust, Gordo, Parkman, Crispy808, MST3 Clay, Fancy Pants, Anonymous, Mr. Turbois, Phone Losers of America, Benjamin, Despicable Dogs, Big Boy Farts, 666, Jesus Painus, and Turbo, the High Level Squirrel. Thank you to everyone for helping support the show. You can find our Patreon over at patreon.com forward slash Madhouse Militia. Our YouTube is at Madhouse Militia as well. If you want to find out more about the show, you can find us at immoralhole.com. Our old show is over at travelswithmiriam.com. If you want to contribute to the show, you can visit immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Hello? Hi, yeah. Uh, you have things. Who is this? Oh, I'm the man, the handyman. I'm here to change your electrical switches. You're here to change my electrical switches. Yeah, your your number's up, uh, and, and I called it because you're looking for a handyman. I'm don't just, need I'm Mr. Don't, handyman. Don't need them. Well, why the fuck your shape. number up there? They got to uh, good shape. Why? Why? Front desk. This is Karen. Hello? Hi. Yeah. I'm out here, uh, I'm walking around the parking areas here, but there's some weird people, and they were twerking, a lady's twerking with her kid here, and they said, oh, yeah, I, work for, the I work for the war, the uh, first floor What floor here. is the parking garage? Number okay. one. Uh, yeah, and what then, the uh, what is this? And then, what floor are you guys on? Oh, like, what, um... Location is this? What do you mean? What location is this? Oh, it's the Grove Hotel. Um, is it the public? That's what I'm calling. Yeah, is it the public parking? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, and then um, we'll have engineering go, or not engineer. We'll have security go and take a look. Well, you better send an engineer because a lady's got her wheelchair flipped over here. And she's called out in pain, and she's not hurt or nothing, but her wheelchair, the wheels fell off. She, she needs an engineer to help her put them wheels back on. Um, so I do have to put you on just a brief hold, if that's okay. Hotel, All right, a reservation, or wait. just want to say oh, hi, God damn reach it. us anytime by texting us at 208-54... Thank you for calling the front desk. This is Angel. How can I assist you? Hey, big angel. I got a goddamn problem right here. Yeah? What's the problem? There's this German guy right here. He was trying to feed me some tacos. What the fuck is this all about? Yes, no, we'll just put on the bib. You'll have a bite now. You know this Are guy? Are you staying with us by the chance? What the fuck is this shit? Him for yeah, the hotel. I was right here in the hallway. I'm right, and he says he worked for y'all. Yes, we see a hotel. Um, we see what floor? Show. I'm in the top floor, the big one. This one just came out of the elevator talking about feeding me tacos. He wants to make me eat his chorizo. What the fuck is no, that all about, off, boo? Off, open what your floor? mouth. I'm at the top what floor, floor the did one you on say? the top. And this one just won't back the fuck up. I'm about to fucking smack this fool, dog. The flug sweat go in your mouth and goes um, I open wide the outline. <laughs> this motherfucker put a taco in my mouth. What the fuck is that? Now, um, now wipe your mouth here, here. Take your bib. Mm, mm, mm. 
I do have to go. Um, if you no, need help, just give us a call. Give us a call back. This is open CV too. Oh, perfect. I have the microphone. Everything is securely stored on our servers. <laughs> Sierra Sky Ranch, this is Diana, can I help you? Hi, yeah, I'm here with my friend and he said that your toilet has oh. AI and when we sit down on it, it takes pictures of everything. And he saw my, took a picture of my pictures eye. online. I'm sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. Your toilet Yes, camera. I have installed a new bidet on this toilet here for you guys and so this will take pictures, it will clean you super good, it will spray when you do number two. Completely what are you complimentary about? to the hotel. This is a hotel. I want you to fuck my ass. Agency, may I help like you? It's crazy. Hi, Hello? yeah, I'm here with Can my family, and we're trying to figure out bookings for tonight. We need a room uh, yeah, for I eight have room men. Here. Do you have room for eight people? Yeah. Oh, okay. One room, no eight and people. Can we have separate, eight people in the room? room? Yeah, oh, one one room, no know. eight people. Well, we're we're half people. You we're have eight machines. people, but is a uh, separate separate room. Okay, so how many people to a room? Is it two or four? Two. Uh, two oh, bed, okay. four people. Two bed, well, two I bed, can, two four people. We can disconnect our arms and our legs and store them in a separate room. Yes, separate room. Two, uh, uh, two bed, four people, each room. Okay. Well, how many? So two people per room per machine. Yeah. So four. How many beds to a room? Two bed. Two. Okay. So four men, one bed. Yeah. Room. Okay. Well, that works. I think. Let You're me welcome. put my engineer on. many spaces. Well, let me huh? put my engineer on. Let me put the engineer on. He has to uh, figure out the constraints for the, the machines that we have to install when we come in. We have Here, sir, how many spaces do you have available? What what type of machine? Uh, life yeah, support how much machines. Of machine? the life huh? support it's and a oxygen. Big the oxygen machine. Uh-huh. Yes, yeah, sir. I got a rational scooter oh, yeah. here, and I need to find yeah, out yeah, how you, much you of the space. No problem inside. Oh my God! That okay, rational feels scooter. So good. Okay, I'll do a burnout. Here, talk to my son here, Daddy. Can you breathe into my machine? Hello. Yes. Yes, sir. Uh, you want um you want the machine that you want the machine that makes tacos? But I don't have machine any. But can we use your machine to make tacos for you? Yeah, you use your machine, no problem. But do you want tacos? Do you like tacos? No. You you don't like tacos? You don't want any? No, no needed. Come on, man. I want to give you something for me. No, no. It's okay, but thank you. Come uh, on, man. Please. No. no. Come on, man. Please. No, no. No need that. <laughs> you don't like um, chicken? No, I don't. Uh, I'm a vegetarian. Vegetarian? I can make you a taco with potatoes and lettuce. No, but I know. Uh, I'm today. Uh, uh, my uh, I have a two-day past. Oh, you got a two-day fasting. Yeah. Okay, buddy. Okay. We're gonna go now. Okay. We're gonna yeah. go now. Maybe we coming later. I love you. I yeah. Love you, you. You come. No problem. You welcome. We're in the church now. We are gathered. We hear Turbo do a call. The thing we call live. I don't think I got to answer. Uh, oh. There's a deal. Hi, um, I'm in the big room, and uh, these people 
like a big group of people in robes showed up. They sat there from the jerk, the church of the machine, and they have a little organ. They're playing. I'm in the big group. Take five Close shave. Pick, pick, you know this. I said, Doctor. Thank you for calling Route 66 Casino. This Can is Tyrus. Can you relieve this bellyache? I'm in a coconut. Hello, I'm hearing voices. I need help. Hey, they're going to start fucking in your shower. You better go Don't stop them. Do. They're saying awful stuff to me. I, I, nah. I don't know, man. It's I think I need help. I'm hearing voices. Butt. These, <laughs> these <laughs> guys, they're going to start <laughs> fucking in your shower. You better guys, one at a time. <laughs> 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 one at a time. It's not a crime. Hello? <laughs> Okay, so basically, Big Milkman put a lime in the coconut, and then Elasma started sucking on it, and they're going to go take a shower with Dr. Unk, and I told them not to, because then they're going to start fucking. This is going to happen in the hotel room. Uh, yeah, yeah, of course it is, man. That's what we pay for. We'll clean up. We yeah, have and then we, have we got we Turbo. Down. We don't make a mess. We got Turbo you know, talking about I, stomping on the waffles that he put in the waffle maker. I told him not to do it, but yeah. he's going to stomp look, on them in the carpet. We're clean. We're clean people. I don't have hepatitis anymore. Can I turn it off first? But, like, you I guys are, have a tarp. You guys are fun. And why don't you come join us in Big Boy? We got some mess. You can switch you some mess. You just tell me where. Like, you just... You just point me in the direction. We're, like, we're in the like big room. Like we're in the okay. big room. Can I call big room? you? Is it safe? Can I call you Big Papa? We're in the I, big room. Oh, dude, and then we got Cat here. Cat's here being fucking crazy again. You need to come stop her. She's about to jump yeah, out the window or something. Too, in case you're like not like you know super I'm into the dude home. thing. She like, took too much. Dude, I mean, you can be like the conductor on this train we're about to run on her, you know, if that's your thing. <laughs> you want to be the caboose? The caboose, you say? Yeah, hey, tell him, tell him what you let him do to you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, girl. Wait, I Go just ahead, noticed Kat, you can hear speak. these. You, the, he, no, he's sorry. been talking Go to my ahead. voices. You can hear these voices. I'm not crazy. No, I hear you. It's in your butt, Loud boy. It's clear. in your butt. Oh, my yeah. God. Listen, listen. Have you, like, for five grand, would you let a dude, like, blow a load on your face? Like, like I'm the real. Like, for five grand. For yeah, five? It's like else two back. seconds. You don't have to do anything with your mouth or anything. It's just, like, quick, would you, easy, like, Would you 5G. let her put a finger up your butt? No, that's just not the one. question. Yeah. He's <laughs> talking about full-on, just a face shot. Yeah, just, like, a quick face shot. But, like, she'll, she'll like, bro, milk your prostate if that's not... what you're into, too. I mean, I'm just saying, look, look, I got five Gs right now, and I'm sick of fucking all these <laughs> other dudes. And, like, I've already nutted in this broad way too much. And if you want to take a, a trip, that's cool, too. I'm just saying, I got five grand right now. I'll blow low right on your your mouth. I got Clorox wipes. You exactly. clean that up. It's five Gs. You know what I'm saying? Quick five Gs. I'll give him another two if I could take time. a video just to get a surprised reaction when he's like, oh, oh. Mm. Everybody does that what, that one minute when they're like, who? Nah, you don't need the video. I'll just keep it in my spank bank. Look, look. look yeah, um. You might be surprised to know, but I shoot a it's pretty a impressive song. rope myself. What? I'm sorry. Let, let the man talk. Let the man cook. What? Oh, I was just, I, I you mean. You said you can bust the fat load yourself? Yeah, I can, I can yeah, shoot a rope. Yeah, like five grand. Like, but I couldn't look. not on a dude's face. You want to put your money where your mouth is? You got to close your mouth. mouth. Like I don't need them. Maybe a back shot. Are you like Peter North? Yeah. No, you got to do the pearl necklace. necklace. Have a little class. Yeah. Um, I mean, look, no, that's a little. Got, Peter, I mean, Peter North's a little old. That's that's more. Well, I mean, yeah, well, you can't vintage. like argue that he didn't like fucking throw the rope. No, he did like Spider Man. He's like no, Spider-Man he's on the face. Line. He was packing. Dude, that's what I'm saying, man. Like, look, I'm not gay or anything, but like, sure. dude, you gotta come on. The man's like product. Like, look, I mean, yeah, look, don't be yeah. gay. I mean, you gotta when you see a nice dick, you usually be like us. You know, I gotta appreciate it. You don't be gay. Yeah, about and dick. like, I'm yeah. not gay or anything, but like, I need to blow my load on somebody news face. Like, I got all these other perverts that I hang out with and ride my truck you with, like, like a big boat. Yeah, like like a, like a big rig. I just work. Work. And I got five uh, grand. Like I'm a trucker and I got trucker money. So it's like, what am I going to spend it on? Meth? 
Yeah, I do. But also, like, I gotta, like, scratch that sex pervert itch. You know what I'm saying? Like, look. That's you know, crazy. we all got needs. And there aren't any, like, hey, I don't want to cut you guys in this parking lot. I, I, I do not want to cut you guys short, but I got the, the other line going, too. Um, and they may have oh, that's an fine. Oh, that's fine. They may have play. Play. It's another hey, thing. Like, like, cut you short. Great. Five Please grand. Do. It's five grand. I will. Yeah. Yeah. I will. Five yeah. grand. Five oh, grand. Love it. Yeah. No, right. Five you. grand, man. My, 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 my thank you. Yeah. I'm not going to beat off Hello, the dead horse. The door is open. Oh, my God. Let's get in here. All right. Away we go, guys. All right. I like that guy. That guy. Looks like that. I like the arm reaching into fucking Lucille Ball's mouth there. Hello, and thank you so much for calling Loves and Balloons. Store 726. This is Lauren. How can I help you? Hey, Big Lauren, how are you doing? I need I need help in the big truck in the back. Oh, okay, indeed. Uh, I'm going to place you on a brief hold. I need to radio my tire shop to see if they're available, okay? No, 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 no. You don't got to do that. You don't got to do all that. It's all right. I'll be good. I just need your help. Indeed. Um, For, for what exactly? So Kat's right here, my wife, she's talking all this shit. Um, she says that it's only one person allowed in the shower, but I keep telling her two. Can you tell her that there's two allowed in the shower so we can go take a shower together? If not, you know, I'm going to have to shower by myself, and I fucking hate doing that shit. So can you talk to her, please? <laughs> um, indeed. So, yes, just to clarify, we do allow two people at once in one shower. Kat. Big fat cat, many, where are okay, you? Okay, yeah, big fat. All right, what? Sorry, I just woke up. Here, the lady said it's okay. She's going to tell you the, the truth. Uh, yes, ma'am. So uh, you are allowed to have two people in a shower at one time, yes. It is It is okay with us um, as far as two people. Normally, we kind of like keep an eye when it's like three or four, but two people is perfectly fine. Well, what if it's two plus two? Um, well then, the, like, so, uh, as a couple, it's sets of two, right. So as a couple of two, you would have one shower for each two. So it'd be two showers if you have four, a total gotcha. of four people. Um, if they're I'm going like, to take the children, phone to the other room real quick. Sorry. Um, oh, I'll be right no, back. No worries. Um, uh, absolutely. If, if they're sorry, children, then they are allowed in the same shower as you guys, just an FYI. So I actually don't want to take a shower with him. So if you could just please get back on the phone with him and tell him that only one person is allowed in the shower. Right. I, I do have a line. Um, I mean, our, our showers are available. If you want to take a shower, you're more than welcome to pay for your own shower to have it separate. But, I mean, just to clarify our policy, yes, we do allow two people, but you're more than welcome to buy your own shower, ma'am. <laughs> Okay, there's no uh, way to right. tell him when I get back in the other room that there's one person that's allowed in the shower only. Can you just tell him that for me, please? Well, yes, ma'am, but again, I, I do have a line. I, I do have people standing in front of me waiting to check out. So, I mean, if, if, okay, you, not have any more, if you guys don't have any Hello? more questions, then... Here, talk to him. I don't want to talk to you. So, we can both take a shower or just one? Yes, sir. I've clarified with you both. You're more than welcome to both come down here and take a shower. You're more than welcome to both purchase your showers individually. If you didn't want to take a shower with the other person, that's perfectly fine. But I do have a line in front of me. Do you have any other questions for me at this she time? She doesn't want to take a shower with me? Is that true? That's not what I'm saying, sir. You would have to like figure that out with her. But again, do you have any other questions for me? I you do don't want to take a shower with me? God damn you. All right. No, well, thank you, sir, for calling. You guys have a great rest of your night. Bye-bye. No, I'm here. Just you, you not clever. They're into big <laughs> spoon and, and they want a spoon. Hey, we got a fucking problem going on right here. Wonder if you could help me out, big bro. What's up? Well, we're all here in the big truck in the back. It says big trucking. It's me, Turbo, Doctor Unk, and Cat. See, so Cat's talking shit. She's over here saying no one knows how to do it. So we're wondering if you can help us, bro. What's up, man? <laughs> yeah. Kat, hey, hey. She says like no one knows how to finger her. If you can just come over here and try and put your finger in her hole because she don't like <laughs> how we're doing it, bro. 
Yeah, dude. <laughs> like, it's been a night, and we're all a little high on meth, so we can't really keep it up. But, like, I tried to find her. her like, you don't right believe me, bro. You don't believe right. me. Like, here she's and right here. Cat's right here. Said, That's not there. That's <laughs> they don't know how to do shit. I'm curious what you'll tell them. Because I feel like they any, should you know by tips? this point. I'm sorry, I don't have any advice. Look, man, we'll pay you. We'll pay you. We got trucker oh. money and like. And what like about drugs. that girl in the background? I don't even need to do drugs, but like, look. Yeah, ask the girl. She'll know. She has my same lady. Let's person. ask yeah, the girl. Can you tell her where the clitoris or ask her where the clitoris is? Because like, I've just been like poking <laughs> at places outside. Pilot Flying J, how can I help you? Hi, I was wondering if you could help me out. I'll try what my wife Hello? Bappy and Kat they um we were parked right here on the side of the truck that says big trucking in the back uh-huh and I Hello? was wondering if you knew how to finger a woman because I don't know how to finger her we ain't got time to play on the like phone that. and you're sick Quality assurance purposes. Oh, Don't stop monitoring. the crashing. Yeah, like, look, friendly faces. I need, like, a friendly face that I can, like, unleash as well. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I got you, like, your introduction call about those, like, friendly faces. And, like, look, do you have, like, a friendly face I can, like, you know, unleash this, like, big old, like, load I've been working up while driving on, um, like, look, money's no object, I'm a trucker, it's not like I have any disposable, like, cat, like, things to spend it on, but, like, dude, I'll pay, like, five grand if I can just, like, bust a nut, you know what I'm saying? Like, look, I'm a weird, like... <laughs> I'm like a weird truck pervert, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got like a big old load in my back, and I got a big old load in my front, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got, I got like fucking a gram of mess in me, and I also got like a, a ton of like celiopostropedic beds in the back, you know what I'm saying? All of them are shrink wraps, I mean, like, that's a no-go, but like, look, I mean, hey, you want to like come in? I got, like, mood lighting and stuff for, like, five grand, you know what I'm saying? Uh, do you have any, like, cute girls there? And if not, like, that's cool, too. Like, I'll even take a dude. It's just as long as I can be like, hey, look, I need to, like, finish on someone, you know? <laughs> oh, man, I'm just some hurting, man. Like, I don't know. What's your name? Brandon. Pretty cute. <laughs> Brandon. All right. Well, like, how does five grand sound to, like... You know, like just you know, two and a half like minutes of time. I mean, it's five grand. Like, shit, like Aaron got their price. I mean, like, you could you could buy a new computer with that or a fucking like, used car. And you don't have to tell anyone, man. I don't tell anyone about that. Like, it's just how I roll, man. And just oh, like, you know, just go to random truck stops after doing a fucking bunch of math while I'm delivering my vehicles. And then I'm just like, yeah. Oh, yeah. And there aren't any lounge, like, there aren't any, like, girls around. Like, normally there's a couple at the truck stops, you know, with local girls who, like, need a little bit of extra cash, you know, single mothers and shit. But I don't see any, man. And I just need you know, a, I just need to unleash, you know, I need to unleash the dragon. Like, you know, Cisco. You know, he had that thong song. You remember that song, thong song? You know, he was like, and it was off the album, Unleash the Dragon. Hello? Help the eyes, the man. Eyes. Yeah, because yeah, he's not Poor looking at the camera. Just like, For quality assurance purposes, I don't care. this call is being recorded or monitored. And the cane is pointed away. Blood is my fuel! Which is kind of unsettling <laughs> to some read. Make my profile picture on Facebook. Uh, Thanks for YouTube. calling Love Store 311 in Waco, Georgia. This is Steve speaking. How can I help you? Hello? Hi, hello? hello? Yeah. Hi, Steve. Oh, yeah. good. Yeah, listen, uh, I've got a truck here. It's got a Bramble Bus problem. Do you got uh, you got the hoses over there? Uh, no, our shop is closed until 6.30 in the morning. 
Okay. Uh, where can I park? Uh, I don't know if there's any parking available out there right now. I believe we're full. Oh, uh, anywhere else? Not that I'm aware of. No. Because oh, uh, you can't you can't park in the fire lane. Just make sure you don't do that. They will call a tow truck. Oh, that that already <laughs> happened, and we have a situation out here. Oh. That's why I was yeah. calling because I wanted to let yeah. you know we got a situation brewing with the lanes here, and the, the man he came by and he hooked my truck up to his truck and he tried pulling it away, and that only made matters hey, worse because I'm a, a, a dually. Yeah. You're gonna miss the exit. You're gonna miss the exit. Why? You're gonna miss the exit. Pull over. No, everything's fine. Oh. Everything's perfectly fine. Oh. Oh shit! Oh, you just crashed, man. Are you good? I told him he gonna miss the exit. Well, today what? ain't your lucky day, cause I'm taking your pants off, cause you can't move. No, oh. oh. I lost my flip flops. Give me your fuck too. pants now. Bend over. Quit that! That tickles. Stop it. Let don't go. Move. listen. Don't move and wiggle. Hello? Hey, hello? hello? Yeah, hello? Yeah, um, I saw your ad on Craigslist about the clown painting. You, is that still available? Yes. Oh, man. Dude, Jack Byers, like, is kind of, kind of important. I don't know. Like, okay, so you, you asked for 50. Like, how is the frame? It looks, it looks pretty nice, but... So, like, is he holding the cane? All right, all right. Like, where did you get this? Like, I need the provenance for it. I'm, like, an art collector, and Jack Byers is not, like, an unknown clown painter. Look, that's my niche. I know some people are into modernism and stuff, but... (laughs) Yeah, no, I Googled him as well. I I I didn't... I didn't find much about him. I Googled him myself. I didn't find much about him. I picked it up in a state in a state well, cell. So I just want to get rid of it because I don't have room for it so anymore good. to hang it. Oh, I just dude, want to no get shame. rid of it because I, mean, I don't. Like, it's, yeah, because it's spooky as shit. Like I have not seen like an unnerving clown painting like that in a while, and I love it. And I need it in my yeah, collection. Yeah, I know it's old. Like, I, I know whole, it's old. I know it's. It's great, but, like, he's looking off and he's holding that cane, and he looks like, like, this has to be before John Wayne Gacy, you know, before, like, clowns were, like, extra scary. Like, this is pre-Stephen King, like, you know, Pennywise shit. Like, and that's the kind of stuff I love. Like, sorry. Okay, are you look, interested? Look, I, I don't want to, you... like, overstate it. Like, I'll give you 50 for it, of course, the asking price. I'm not going to, like, undercut value it. I just want you to know, like, I appreciate you collecting that clown painting because, like, I have, like, a whole hallway full of them, and, like, this is probably one of the most unsettling ones I've seen. Like, he looks like he's, he's, like, you know, drowned like a bunch of kittens. And that's, like, that's the whole thing with clown art is, like, it's, like, the, what you imagine the clown is thinking or has done recently. Like, that's... That kind of thing. Like, I know that you don't even care. You don't even care, really. But like, no, no, just, it's all good. I mean, I, I, listen. I always like to, I always like to learn stuff. So, but I just, I had it hanging on my wall for a while, and I just don't have room for it anymore. I've got some more art. No, I got it. So did did, did anyone, so did anyone wrote, that came wrote, over wrote was just like, yeah, no, I get it. No did one, anyone that came no, over the like, first, dude, you're, you're the first, you're the first, you're the first person. I just, I just, I just. I just listed it. You're the first person who uh, who called. Oh, you mean friends looking at it? Yeah, they. Everybody always comments yeah. on it, as you know. Everybody comments on clown. Yeah, pictures. do they go like? But this, this one's hand painted really too. Creepy. Yeah, no, I I know that. And it's like okay. acrylic, and you can kind of see like the valuing on it, like and that pain. Like you have to imagine, like, did he like choke someone with it? I mean, that's the mystery. 
But he looks like he's like so cold and like sociopathic that like it doesn't matter. You know, like he doesn't care about murder. He's just a clown. He's gonna like he's gonna juggle his bowling pins and he's gonna breathe fire and do cartwheels. Look, that's kind of the whole thing. And like Jack Byers is like I know you didn't find him like online. <laughs> like I assure you, I've got no, I found a little. I there. found a little bit. I one. didn't. I didn't find that. I didn't find that much about him. I found very little about him. I knew that he, he was an artist. That's all I found. But he did, he did other stuff besides clown stuff. Yeah, but like his clown stuff is like super big. Like there's one where it's like uh, looking up and like it's like an imposing figure looking down at the camera, and there's like red on his like multicolored like you know a top. And it's just like, is that blood? But it's ambiguous enough that like you don't know. Like, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna shame anyone for their like creative expression, but I feel like Jack Byers had like kind of like a an edge to him, you know? Like, he was into some like things, you know, before before it became a cool thing to be like a creepy clown, you know, do you rope tricks and you know everything floats down here and shit. Yep. So yeah. are you interested in, well, okay. in well, getting it? Yeah, of course I am. Of course I am. And that frame, <laughs> okay. oh, dude, like, oh, man. That's like an old frame. Imagine it's an the old... things he's done. Dude, I mean, it's fine. I can always reframe it. Like, for a piece like this, yeah. I mean, honestly, it's like, I mean, like, when you look at him with that yellow tie, it's like, you know that, like, he's totally, like, choked someone really hard before he, like, went on stage. And it's like, I'm going to get in this car and drive around. Like, that's the whole thing with clown art is, like, imagining what they're doing before the performance and circus thing. Like, you know, sometimes they bumble around and things and get drunk and stagger around. Like, that's their niche. But, like, this guy has the, the feel. And that's the whole thing when, with me as an art collector, clown guy. Like, I've made a couple grand off of, like, clown art. Like, it's kind of my thing. But, like, this nice. guy, like, looks like he's probably drowned a bag of kittens at some point. Like, he's like, oh, man. He's like, oh, man. You know. You know. Uh-oh, my cat, like, uh-oh, had a whole cat, bunch like, of kittens, and I got to do it. Oh, look at me. I need to do it. I need to do it. I to um, I, I, have to, I have to drop my daughter off right now, and I don't mean to cut off. I love hearing all this stuff, but do you want to set up a time to pick it up? or? Yeah, let me call you back. I'll call you back in like 1520, okay? Like, I'm interested, and please just hold it for me. My name is Dad Johnson. Dad Johnson. Sad? Yeah, fad. Yeah, like, fad. Like, fad. Got like it. Fad. Got it. Got it. Got yeah, it. My parents were like yeah, parents super were like, douchey and white. You know, I was shame on that, shame but, you know, on that, but you know, they're still alive. I can't change my name to like Mark. My name to like Mark. It's all good. Better to be unique. All right, we'll drop your daughter off. I'll call you back in like twenty. Okay. Back in like twenty. Okay. Okay. Bye. All right. Bye. All right. Bye. Thank you for calling, Les. Can you hold, please? No, I can't. I got a goddamn problem. All right. Well, you're going to have to hold, or you're, you can just call back. Thank you for calling, Les. Can I help you? Hey, you just hung up on my boyfriend, fool? What the fuck is that all about? You're not yeah, the yeah, strange. Yeah. Thank you for calling Lowe's 336. Hello? This is Michael. How can I help you? Well, Michael, I'm right here in the in the big truck. On the side of it, it says big trucking. I got a little nail in my hole, in my tire. Yeah. We, uh, I was wondering if you could come help me out really, real quick. Uh, here, hold on. I'll let you talk. I'll let you talk to my supervisor. Here you go. Hold on. No, I just need your help, bro. You can help me. I don't need a. Uh, What's going on? What's up? Are you the supervisor? Yes. All right, so I got a flat, and my there was a nail in, in one of the back rear driver wheels of my 10-wheeler. Okay. And um, I took 
I took the nail out. It was a pretty big ass nail, and I stuck my finger in it to not let the air come out. And I was just wondering if you could help me out. Uh, yeah, we don't have anybody at the tire shop tonight. They won't be in until seven o'clock in the morning. Well, no, bro. I'm just. I have a thing in my truck. I just can't move. I can yeah, patch we, it myself. It's just I can't take my finger out the tire because yeah. if I take my finger out, it'll it'll flat. It'll deflate. So I need you to come stick your finger in my hole for a little bit. Pilot 56. Pilot 56. Hello? Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. My friend's hey, dropping in. What is your problem? Uh, no, I'm not know. listening. Do not call here again. You're the place of business. I'm going to come down there and, and give us something to start talk about, goddamn. You know what? I got your phone number on here. I will call the police. Do not call here again. Yeah, yeah, you ever wonder what Klingons look? Hey, yeah, I, I have a question. Do you ever wonder what Klingons labias look like? Are they as ridged as their forehead? Do they have that like her torso? Thanks for calling Love Fort Mill. Hi, there's a hey, guy. Hey, my friend. Turbo oh, wants sorry, to talk to you. Ahead. There's a guy oh. coming up to the truck and he's harassing us. He's knocking on the window and telling us his name. He hey, says his you... name is Worf, son of Moog. Hey, man, right. do you work with the truck stop? Yeah, is, is everything good? No, not you, Worf here. Oh, no, no nobody uh, should be out there at the moment that works here, at least. He does not sound like a warrior. Where... <laughs> Where are you at right now? I, I'll go out there and uh, deal with the situation. Um, I'm in the truck that says big trucking on the side. Are you in the back parking lot? Yes. We you and I will crush him. We're moving some bales of wire here. my pants back. Sweet. Unlock the door and give me my pants back. It's cold. Meloda. God, the storm. I'm starting to. Hi, you're kind of muddled. I'm sorry? Fix your phone. You're kind of muddled. Can you fix your phone? Allensburg Love, it's Steven. Hey, dude, um, do you guys, like, have your pipes they, that go to the sodas? Do they also run through the water pipes or something? No. Well, because Pappy and Turbo were trying to take a shower, and then for a second I was watching them, and out of nowhere some white shit came up from the shower head, and it looked like milk. It looked like Milkman's milk just shot out of the shower, dude. What the hell's going on with your... Broadway Flying J. Hello? Hi, um, my, my friend Turbo and Milkman, they want to know if you guys have uh, milk, dairy. Milk, yes, there's milk. Hey, partner, ask him if they go to... Here, uh, tell Turbo. Tell Turbo and Milkman here. How do you run it through the shower? Shit. <laughs> How can I help you? Hi, uh, we got disconnected. I was on the phone with a woman there. We got disconnected. Yes, ma'am. How can I help you? For the showers, for bringing multiple people into the showers. You said we couldn't have more than two, but I think that three people make for a proper wash down. Um, no, we, we, we are... It can only be, only be two people. It can't be multiple people. But we're truckers. You you don't want to join us, bro? You don't want to join me and my wife, Bappy? We're hot. <laughs> or like make Wesley crush This is Chelsea. How may I help you? Hey, Chelsea. Thank I had a question. Day this is Chelsea. How can I help you? Chelsea, I had a question. Yes, how can I help you? 
So Hello? me and my wife were trucking. We're big trucking. We were wondering, is it, are we both allowed to take a shower together, me and Bappy? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we have no problem with All that. Right. Just no more than... To- Here you go. You have a good night, Jessica. Well, well, tell my wife that because she doesn't believe me, and I'm trying to, you know, get her to take a shower with me, and she doesn't believe me, so I need you to tell her. Here, I'm going to put her on the phone. They say that three people... That's Sir Patrick Stewart. Hi. Thank you for calling, love. This is Sarah. How may I direct your call? Hello, you're coming Hello. back. Hello. Oh, yeah. Hi, yeah, we're in the truck lane here. This is big trucking. The big red truck out here. And there's a guy out here, and he keeps trying to get into my truck. Uh, where in the... What side Over are in you? I'm in the gas the... lane. I'm in, I'm in the diesel lane. You're in the diesel lane? What truck, what, um, yeah. what diesel number? What tr- um, what I don't gas know, number I didn't you see at? it. I didn't see it. Uh, it it's, it's over here on the side here. And this guy, he's, he's knocking on the window. He keeps trying to sell me something. Okay, I'll let security know. I'll let security know. Schnitzel, best you find in town. Cooked it in my own car for you. You'll buy it today for $5. No, I, I don't want. I don't want. Hey, I don't bye. want. I don't want. Thank you for calling Wingate and Hawthorne Suites. This is Aaron. How can I help you? Hello, can you hear me? Yes, I can. I was in the bathroom and the man in there. I just want to make like a complaint. Okay. Uh, what's your room number? I well, this is the bathroom. And when I came into my room into the bathroom, the man was already there. He said he was bathroom attendant, but then like he shaved me and like put on the aftershave and stuff. But then I'm kind of like, okay, time for you to go. But he will not go. I'm not sure. He say he are you sure for you? you? You have the right property. What hotel are you at? Well, yes, I'm. I'm quite sure. I've let me look at my phone. I believe I've uh, dialed the right number. Let me look at them. Yes, this um, the Windrams. You said Wyndham. Yeah, the Windrams. I'm from. Uh, yeah, there. I'm sorry if I'm not saying right. There are right. thirty. There are. There are 35 brands under Wyndham, so I, I do need a more specific name. Um, my name is Johan, and the man, you're not sure you're here, here, asking me, like, you need a shave, you need me shine your shoes, or whatever. But what, what's the name of the hotel? What? I just, I, we, are, we are running apparently in circles, I'm sorry, I'm not, um, I'm from Germany, I'm just not... What uh, so this man you say he not work for you? He will like he tried mm-hmm. to wipe me after the number two, and he just standing here. He's got like a vest and a shirt on, and he just stands in there with his like with his like hands together or whatever. You say not. I'm not sure how things go in America. In Germany, we don't have so many of these anymore. It's like an like an old antiquated thing that people don't know anymore. But. You got the bathroom attendant here. I just want you to ask him to leave. I put him on for you if you want. You just ask him to leave. We, I we don't. Hey, you I, I hand the phone to him. Anyone like that at my hotel? I, I really do think you have the wrong hey, number. Hey, how's it? How's it going? It's me. It's Dad. I'm I'm in the bathroom. This gentleman, he's really cute. Listen, I I shaved him and I tapped my foot. And. Yeah, look, this is my favorite job ever. The La Quinta, like... Yeah, this is not La Quinta. <laughs> Which it's not job? that you're not doing a good job, it's just so much, you know, like, yeah. I, I don't look, need all this effect. Oh, this is Katera cool. speaking. Hey, Katera. Hey, how are you? <laughs> what can I do for you? Oh, I need a room. I'm sorry. I has uh, a short notice thing. Do you have any availability? Yes. I uh, what kind of room like, are you looking for? Oh, oh, I'm just looking for a room that I can like slot down on and just like pass out. Look, I had a night. I did a whole bunch of ketamine. I'm really in a big K hole right now. I won't bring it in there. There's no drugs or anything, but like 
<laughs> oh man, my buddy was just like, hey, do this rail. I thought it was cocaine, like jam me up, but like, no. It was ketamine and I got into a dark place, but I need a place where I can crash and money's no object. Like, what's the cost? Okay, um, so do you want one bed or two? I mean, one, I don't know, unless there's, like, a cute girl, like, hanging out in the lobby. Are there any cute girls hanging out in the lobby? I'm really lonely. Uh, I'll just take one bed. I'll just take one bed. Okay, um, so you're by yourself? Yeah, I am. I am. Like, my okay, friend's so abandoned and me. The phone number, I, punched, the, I punched the bouncer. Okay, so the phone number that I um, that you're calling from, is that going to be the best number for you? It is. It is. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, can you tell me that number? Because it didn't show up. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Um, sorry, I've been on a whole bunch of, like, ketamine tonight. Um, one second here. Let me, let me look at it. Can you just, like, can I call you right back? I'm sorry. I got to, like, look at my phone. Like, I got to text my girlfriend and ask what my phone number is. And be like, I'm sorry, Toots. I'm doing it again. It's okay. We don't need your phone number. It's okay. Forget the phone number. Okay. Thank God. I appreciate you. I appreciate you, Kamara. I'm sorry. I forgot your name already. It's been a long night. I like to remember names, but it's with a K. I know that. I know that. I have enough memory for that, right? Katara. Yeah, thank you. What is your last name? Yeah. Uh, It's um, uh, O'Reilly. All right, first name? Uh, Seamus. It's, what? Um, what? it's like the, I, yeah, it's, it's S-H-A-M-E-U-S. It's a weird spelling. It's like Seamus. I think, I think my dad was like really like not wanting another son, so he called me Seamus. Look, I don't need to like, I'm sorry, I don't want to unpack this. It's been a rough night. Like, oh, you don't oh, have man, to. What's your address? Are, um, it's, uh, 612 Wharf Avenue. Zip code? Uh, zip code is 2001. So it's 2000 and then the number one. Oh, okay. City and state? And that's in Washington, D. Uh, well, oh, okay. it's, it's actually not a state. It's the District of Columbia. Okay. Yep, and it is... It is um, 1500 uh, Beauregard Street in Northwest. Okay, and uh, what car I'm will sorry, you no, be no, holding with Beauregard, today? K, K Street. Um, it's, a, it's a MasterCard. Okay. I'm and sorry. I'm ready. No, 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 no. I lost that one. I lost that one at the bar. Like I, I forgot to close out my tab before I like punched the bouncer. Um, mm-hmm. I have, I have a diners club. You guys take diners club? Yep. What's the number? Oh God bless you, uh, Candace. I really, really appreciate. So the diners club number. Um, sorry. Let me pull it out of here. Sorry, sorry. Uh, Dude, these condoms. Okay, so, all right. So, the number is 300. Mm Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. shit, I dropped it. It, it's, It's 306. Oh, man, the numbers are so blurry. Oh, man, dude. I think I think my ex-girlfriend slipped me a hit of acid. I'm, like, really having a little trouble, like, reading the numbers. Like, I think I might just, like, sit down for a minute. Can I call you right back? Like, yeah, sure. I got to, like, okay, well, I appreciate you so much, um, yep. uh, Katara. Like, well, I'm going to call you right back. Like, don't, don't throw the baby out with the bathwater. I mean, look, look, I am so lonely right now, and you sound nice. And sound like somebody I'm who cares work about people. And I cannot just be sitting on the I mean, that doesn't mean you can't be a nice person. You can't be a nice, not a nice person. I mean, it doesn't really Yeah, absolutely. I, I totally get it. 
Um, but we are. I, your customer kind of, service is so good, so good. <laughs> well, I appreciate that. If you want to make a reservation, um, I'm in touch with Grass for a little bit. Let I'll be call, here until let eleven. Me call okay. You, let me call you right back. All okay. right. Thank you All so right. much, um, bye -bye. Kelly. I appreciate you. It's about people. Good evening. How may I help you? This is the Wesleyan. The Wesleyan. Hello. Uh, hello. 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 This is the Wesleyan. How may I help you? Hello. I am here outside um, in the parking lot, and I was to get a room here. But uh, when I pull in, I look up and I see, I'm not sure the count in the numbers, I'm from Germany, I'm not sure if it's the second or the third floor. If that, I'm not sure if I even got the numbers right. But there's someone, it's not the first floor, they're up. And I see in the window, like there's some light from behind, I can see the silhouette of like two people. And I want to let you know like what I'm seeing because it seems like it's a problem, you know. All right. So it's like the silhouette of two people doing like adult things, and so like the woman is pressed against the window, and I can see her brust water, if you did chest from her, and I feel like you need to know that. All right, I'll have someone sit up there to take care and of that. The window, oh my, the window is slightly open. I not know if you. I hold the phone up to see if you can hear them. They're making these crazy noises. Oh my God! They are doing. I can see they are. Oh, they are yeah. doing this. This. This thing. Oh. I'm not sure the American words. Oh, I'm such a big oh. stepdaughter. Oh. But they are up there, and I can see them doing it in the window. You are like. You may have to go up there and like knock the door. Oh, and... oh. All right. I'll get that taken care of. Thank you. Oh my God! Oh, are you allowed into the hotel? There's like a whole show. Is this? Hi, yeah, we're yeah. here. Uh, here, here, I'll uh, give the phone. Yeah, okay, I'm at the, um, yeah, you heard the band? Yes, yes, I'm with the band, a hotel council, and we need a place to stay. Do you have a room? Yeah, we do have rooms available. Oh, thank God, thank God. I am, I am, um, how you say, uh, from Germany. Uh, I had uh -huh. a contact. And uh, our hotel cancelled, double booked. It was like yeah. Lufthansa, they overbooked. Yes, I need the room. I need the room. Uh, I don't know if you've heard of us. We are pretty big. Our name is Kraftwerk. Have you ever heard of the band Kraftwerk? Uh, I'm not aware about that. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, yeah, it's okay. You've definitely heard the music, but you don't know where it comes from. It's fine. I'm not going to fault you for that. But I need a room for me and my other robots. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, we need uh, one room with uh, a bed. Uh, one, I'm sorry, uh, how you say One, one bed. Ein, ein, one room. Ein, uh, one bed. Uh, uh, four, uh, four, uh, four robots, uh, four men, four men, four men. Uh, ein, ein bed und four men. One bed, four men. For one bedroom, it would be only for two people. So you need to get like two rooms if you want no, to get nine, like for four nine, people. Nine, uh, or we, you can get like a two spoon, bedroom. We big spoon, we big spoon. We will pay for two rooms, but we all sleep in the same bed. It makes us better musicians. Okay. Like we will pay for the two rooms, but we like to snuggle. We like okay. to big spoon each other. I'm I'm the biggest spoon. I am uh, the serving spoon, <laughs> as as my friends say. My big loafer love a and you're the big spoon. Ah uh, yes, I I am cool. It's cool. Yes. Okay. 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 They're definitely they don't, don't say it, don't say it. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. I'm bed. Fun, fun, fun on the other urban. <coughs> Hello, Aile. Yeah. 
We will just need yeah, your ID yeah, and that will be that. fine. We will all need your four IDs. Yes. Oh, of course, of course we have the four IDs. We are Americans. You need our passports. We yeah. are from Germany. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Passport would be fine. fine. They are German. Um, if you need, I can tell you what the words mean. They are in German. And I want to make your job as easy as possible. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, see, you know German. I can ambition in Deutsch. It's so good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's schnell, schnell. Achtung. All right, I'll reserve your room for you. Like two rooms. Uh, so you yes. can hold the room. Yes, I danke. Danke. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Um, you can put it under the name Klaus. Klaus Kinski. Okay, I will like hold it two rooms for you. Uh, so, but it, it would be first okay. come first serve. So, if any other customers comes in oh, yeah, before then, I may have to give them give the room. So, try to come as early as possible. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, you can know it's me because it's um my name is Klaus Kinski, and um one of my other bandmates his name is Werner Hilsdorf. Okay. Um. See you soon then. Okay. And, and and the other bandmates are Irvin Rommel and uh, Dietrich Schopenhauer. Okay. Sounds good. We've been doing a lot of the cocaine. We won't bring it into the hotel room or anything. We like to keep the boundaries, but uh, we will be there shortly. I appreciate you. Um, how do you say? Um, you are a credit to your race. Um, uh, okay. Schnief, the powder, put it in my nose, rub it on my knee place. Alright, I'll see you soon. I'll hold you up a room. Uh, yeah, and yeah, I have like a customer up there in the front desk, so. It's fine, it's fine. Look me up though. It's Kraftwerk. You can look up fun on the Autobahn. Okay, you know, the I'll Autobahn look up that. Where you drive the fast. Yeah, you should. It's good. It's good. We are kind of a big deal. Yeah, all right. All right. we'll see you Sir, soon. Hello, hello. Yes, this is the yeah. manager. We are a little bit busy with a customer here. So when you come here, it's we fine. can give it's you all the information you need. Yeah, huh? of course. We'll be here shortly. I'm sorry, okay. don't mean to distract. Yeah, yeah. yeah. thank yeah. you. Yeah. Bye-bye. Yeah, yeah, thank you. No, no, just unless it takes the Deutsche Marks. <laughs> Yeah, that's great. Okay, who's going to take this? Mein German? Ein, ein Bische? Johan, Johan. Hello, can you hear me? Scotsman friend is speaking. You hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I'm calling you from the tour bus here. Uh, we are coming to your hotel. We are looking for rooms for about 35 people. We are here on the tour bus. Everyone say hello to America. Hello. So yeah, you got rooms? So Red you were in. Sweet, sweet. No. Hello. Hey, 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 how's it going? Hey, it's yeah, good. hey, can you hear me? Yes, can I help good, you? Good, good, yeah. All right, how are you doing tonight? Like, I know it's it's kind of tough working nights, but how's it going? Like, it's going great. Can I help you? Nice. <laughs> oh yeah, no, I'm I'm looking for a little bit of help here. You okay. see, yeah, I mean, look, I, I don't know, I don't know how things have been going in your life, but <laughs> I'm so sorry. What what's your name? I'm sorry. My name is my name is Thad. And I'd like to know who I'm talking to. Um do you are you looking for a room? Yeah, yeah. Like I'm in the parking lot right now, like had a rough night. I just started driving and I ended up here and I'm just kinda like hanging out on my like Sierra. And I'm just smoking cigarettes, and I don't know. I just want to see if there's, like, a room or, like, you know, what's going on. Like, I don't want to, like, just show up and, like, talk to somebody. You seem nice, but I'm not going to, like, 
be that creepy guy that's like, oh, oh, I'm just going to, like, stumble in there and, like, you know, try to make friends. I, I don't know. Like, listen, listen, my kids just left me. Like, I disowned one of them because he was, he was, uh, he liked boys. And I'm a, I'm a Pentecost. So, like, I don't, I don't know. Like, but I was living with him at the time. So, like, I kind of shot myself in the own foot there, you know? Like, I'm not a... I don't... Hello? Thank you for calling Hi. Me. Hi. Yeah, hi. I was walking by, and it took him inside. It took him in. There was a big uh, hole, a crack in the foundation of the hotel, and it opened up, and it took him inside. What was that? There's a big crack out here in the in the building, and it, it opened up, and there's a big void, and it took him. It swallowed him whole. And it said, yummy, yummy in my tummy. And the hole, it was gaping. Where, what happened? I don't know. Well, where'd he go? I put my brother on. Maybe he can talk to you and you can talk to him about the the man that took the thing. Okay. Okay. Brother, take the phone. I want to go in the hey, 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 sorry, sorry. My, my brother witnessed something, like, pretty, pretty unnerving. Um, I saw it, too, but there was this guy, and the, it took him. It took him into a gaping hole. And he fell in, and he was all like, "Ah!" And uh, have you ever seen that movie Star Wars: Return of the Jedi, where like Boba Fett like falls into that hole, and yeah. he's all like, Ugh. "Yeah, it was like that, except like real life. Like it's a sinkhole. It's like on the west side of the building. Where and it was like it was like the it was on like the west side of the building. It was like I don't know. He's like." still down there, I think. I don't know. It's pretty deep. It's like a cavernous, like, gaping hole. And I tried calling down there, and he was like, I'm still here. And I just don't know. Like, I don't have a whole lot of rope in my car. Listen, I'm a mountain climber, but I don't have enough rope to get there. I threw it down, and he's all like, I can't reach it. Thank you for calling Hampton Inn and Suite. Siobhan speaking. How can I assist you? Siobhan, I need a favor. Who is this? My name's Gerber. Uh, me and my wife, Bap, are in the room, and I just need a huge favor. Okay. So, me and my wife, Bappy, we're estranged, and, like, we finally got back together, and we're trying to just, on this little vacation, you know, to restore some type of fire in our relationship. Isn't that right, baby? Yeah. Oh, wait, yeah, they Thank did. you for calling Hampton. How can I help you? Hey, 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 I have a question. Up? Hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, listen, no, listen, I don't mean to cut my uh, brother off here, but... I just really need to, like, pick your brain here. I'm really not in a great place. And um, I just wanted to see, like, do you guys have rooms available? No, we do not. We're sold out tonight. Oh, my God, really? Okay, well, is it cool if I, like, sleep in the parking lot? Because, like, I don't know. I'm a little drunk and I don't want to drive right now. I'm not gonna lie. Like, and I'm already here. Is is it cool if I just like hang out and just like you know sit on the hood of my car and smoke cigarettes and kind of watch people go in and out of the the hotel and just like like hey you know what's up you know and then just like unload a whole bunch of emotional baggage on it. Don't answer that phone. You're talking to me right now. I get it. I get it. But like I'm your priority. Like you know. That's my brother. Anthony and Tarantula, how can I help you? Hi, Tarantula, how are you? I'm sorry? 
I said, hi, Tarantula, how are you? I'm not a tarantula, sir. That's, that's not what you just said? That's in Hanson and in San Angelo. How can I help you? Yeah, I, I see. I have uh, uh, rachnophobia. I'm scared of women with small chests. I'm sorry? I'm scared of women with small chests named tarantula. I have a phobia. Oh, then you should probably hang up then, sir. Oh, are you? See, you just said you weren't a tarantula. Now you're a lion. You're a lion, little spider. Yeah, I lie. Eh, typical woman. That's okay. Yep. I'll still marry you. <laughs> That's funny. I'm already married. Yeah, but he doesn't make you happy. Yeah, he does. Don't worry about that. Oh wait, no, I said he. She doesn't make you happy. I'm sorry. Don't worry. She makes me happy too. So. I'm all good over here. See, see, there you go. There you go, lying again. God. Well, go make another spider happy then. Listen, I'll have John Candy come over and burn down your barn. Ooh, I'm so scared. I'm shaking in my little... You should be. You should be terrified of a dead Canadian. <laughs> <laughs> And I said it was the people across the street. Yeah. Thank you for calling Best Western Plus. How can I help you? Hi. How are you? Okay. Okay. Great, great, great. Um, so I urinated in my room and not in the bathroom, just in the room. Somebody uh -huh. needs to come clean. Oh, okay. All right. What's wrong with it? Oh, I I was lazy. I didn't want to. I was watching Law and Order SBU Marathon on USA Network. God bless them, not a sponsor. And I didn't want to miss Olivia Benson's big line to Stabler, so I just peed on the floor in front of my bed, right on the floor. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah. But I did it on purpose. It's it wasn't an accident. It was an on purpose. Okay. All right. Okay. Hold for one. But that, that's what I that's what I pay you that's what I pay you people for. So I felt justified in doing it. Okay, no problem. I will clean it. So give me one second. You damn right. You got yeah. you got damn right. Yeah. Okay. And then after you clean it, I'm gonna do it again while you're still here, so you can keep cleaning. Okay. Katie. Hold on. What's the matter, son? What's the matter? He's a Teddy Machut. Uh, he's a he's a Ben Chod. Uh, he is Teddy Kaposri Ke Ben Chod. Hold on. Okay, one pee, pee on the pillow. He's gonna come up. As, he, this Mara Chod's gonna come clean it. And I'm gonna piss on him on his face. Yeah, yeah. He likes it. He he's from he's from <laughs> India. He's from India. <laughs> Hello. Hello, asshole. Hello? Hi. Okay, so what's the problem? I can't hold my piss. And it went okay. on the floor. You have your and friend, my son, right? My son? Yeah. That's my tell son. Him. He wants to pee on you. Okay, tell him to hold your dick, motherfucker. <laughs> Mother Jod. <laughs> Can I, Benny Lodi? <laughs> you don't even know how to speak that, asshole. <laughs> Yeah, put that all in a grocery bag and put that grocery bag in your asshole. <laughs> How about that? Yeah, with the hooker shirts. Huh? Yeah, sure. Thank you for calling first and please care and speak. Can I help you? Oh. Hello? Hi, you know the hotel across the street? The who? Do you know the hotel that's across the street? Across the street or next door? It's one yes, the hotel that's across the street from you guys. Do you know them? Uh, I don't. Well, I was over there trying to get a room before I came over to this one, and they were talking really mean, nasty things about you guys. Okay. 
Yeah, they said that a lady, and I think he's talking about you, they said that they saw you taking the trash out one night with your male coworker, and you guys went behind the dumpster and you made out with him and he fingered you from behind and all this crazy stuff. Well, sir, I don't know what they're talking about, but you ought to know. You can't believe everything you hear. So, okay. So that's not true then? Uh, no. What? Why did it take you so long to say no? What you mean? I don't have to answer anybody. It's like anybody. you had to think about it. Like, if no. that's not true, you were like, um, like maybe you got caught. No, I get caught doing I'm like this. I don't, I put my energy on what I need to put my energy on. And a lie is not something I can put, like to put my energy you, on. So, you've never done that before? Uh, no. And is you calling uh, for a room? Would you like or, to? Uh, no, sir. I no, I'm not staying there. I'm already in a room. I just wanted to tell you it was on my conscience. Oh, well, you must have the wrong person then. So if you like... Oh, well, maybe it was the other room? girl that works there, and I don't know if one of your girl coworkers fucks the other guy coworker or something when you guys aren't watching. You sound like you are too old to be playing on this phone. So uh, if you're not calling to get a room... I'm just to hang up, or I can uh, have the police call this number that's on our call ID and see what you're talking about. Okay. No, 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 no. You don't have to have them call me. I'm just telling you what the people across Fuck the street the said. I didn't say any of this. Well, keep listening to them. Don't call me with that. So I will have the police give you a call. You have a blessed night. No, you better not hear. Talk to my dad, Dwight. Talk to my dad, Dwight. Hello? There's a pole at the anal beads. Hello? Hello? Hi. Hi, this is Mortals with Sulphur Springs. How can I help you? Yeah, hi. I'm I'm about to pull the last nail out of the roof, and then the roof is going to come off. Daddy. Hello? Hi, yeah. I'm removing the roof on the motel. Uh-huh. It's... <laughs> the roof is a gay, and we're gonna put a straight a straight roof on the top. I mean, what are you talking about? So, no, you know everybody on the second floor. Uh huh. Are you? Tell are them you all to put a. Motor? Tell them a, a, don't a, sh, don't yeah. I'm I'm doing construction. Tell them to all put a coat or a long sweater on because I'm gonna take the roof off for the night. Why? Yeah, we're going to take the roof off for the night because the roof is a gay. The roof is in. What are you talking about? I didn't understand. Do you, you, you know the roof? Yeah. It's a homosexual, so we're going to take the roof off and we're going to bring a straight roof. We're going to bring a cisgender, a cisgender roof. We don't need any construction. Do you talk uh, to the manager Ma about this? Yeah, I, I did. Ma'am, are you a stupid? <laughs> she had to think about it. She's home. Oh, oh, wow. Please. Pulled down oh. his pants. He said, look at me. I got a big PP. Hello? Hello? What's going on, sir? Who are you trying to reach? I'm um, I'm trying to reach you. Oh my God! Regarding what? Uh, uh I, well, I I have a big problem. I got a big old penis and shooting out juice. Thank you for calling Hi, Samson Consulting from Spring, Texas. How can I help you? Hi. Hello. I I, I need someone to come upstairs and, t and take the 
take the carcass out, I guess? The carcass for what room? Huh, for 215. 215? What's the name on that yeah. room? Yeah, well, they, sh- they shut down my butcher shop because of health issues, so I temporarily moved it into room 215. All right, yes, sir. I'll get someone on it. Okay. Thank you. Right. Appreciate Thank it. You. That's great service here. Looking ten and sweet silver springs. Hi, yeah. There's a lady out here and she's twerking. She's going you know, her her bottom half is shaking erratically and, and there's uh there's seagulls and they're they're uh, flying okay, around this is here a and hotel. they're pecking. What am I supposed to do? Well, I don't know. I thought maybe you knew about what was going on out here. This isn't Sulphur Springs, Texas. We don't have seagulls in Sulphur Springs. Well, I don't know. They're birds of some sort. I think she has, like, some sort of bird seed on her pants or something. It's attracting What's your room number? Oh, I'm not staying here. I'm just walking by. Well, then... Hey, I just thought it was you're, strange. Hey, you're not telling her about my birds, are you? Are they your birds? They're my birds. Don't tell but, people about but, my birds. But don't take my phone. <laughs> and bitches up in a single file line. And I'll take Thanks our turns at wax and her behind. Please that kind of shit. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Our name is Harry Otto no Man. Fun the Can't have none. Very Aquaman. Thank you for calling, boys. My name is Terry. Awesome. I hope everything is okay. How can I help you? Hello. I'm gonna I'm gonna fuck this Hello? German guy if you don't get him to fuck away from me. Here, I'm no, gonna no, put him on no. the phone. Hello. Excuse me. You hear me? Uh, hello. How how can I help you? I'm sorry, the man. The man had taken my phone when I was calling you. We were having a bit of a dispute. You said your name was Terry Ottoman. Um. No, my name is Daniel. I am working with the Boise Guest House. How can I help you? Okay. I'm sorry, Daniel. So, um, I'm sorry, I'm from Germany. I, I'm taking some time to adjust, but I have a room with you. As I'm out here in the hall. You hear this man here. He was saying I'm gonna these, fuck him. Yeah, he was saying I'm these things fuck to me. No, no, no. I I'm trying. I was going to get to my I'm, room. I'm kind of like, I. Yeah. Um, step away from him, and please, if you do have any issues with him, feel free to call the officers. If he is doing that well, on our property, I'm, he is harassing you, and we will, that pre- is why we I will trespass him. I'm not harassing nobody. This guy's just fucking around in booty no, shorts with a no, big fat I, ass. Well, I have stepped back, and he has it, stepped towards me again, and he has like put his hands and fingers on my yeah. hip, and I had to like smack his hands off. Yes, you are within your rights as, as a guest in our country uh, to well, like call 911 and report this. Now. No, no, you I didn't. Want to no, 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 no. I will call you for that. I, you said no. If he, has, if he has tried to lay hands on you, that is a threat. Do you need me to come on down? I'd be happy to. I did to. nothing of the I, sort. I did not do that. I didn't do that. He's lying. Don't believe him. Well, I may have exaggerated a little, but you're looking at me like that with your eyes. You're undressing me. He's walking around in booty shorts, and all I did was make a comment saying people in America don't wear booty shorts, especially men. And he said, well, people in Germany walk around. These are not booty shorts. These are Hogan Augenberg. These are German. This gentleman is asking you to leave him alone. Leave him alone. I wear booty shorts, sir. I don't like that I wear short shorts. I don't like it. I'm okay with you not... Sir, I don't I'm like okay it. with you not liking it. Sir, I am okay with you not liking that. But Do not it walk is around with your ass out in front right. of me or I'm going to smack it. Sir, then it I have a right like to you smack your jiggly fat ass. ass. No, you do not. No, sir, you do not Thank have you. a right Thank to smack to to the person's bottom. That is so sexual God harassment. You. You could, like, that is literally, is you not. are literally... Yes, it is. Would you like me to read it? It's not sexual harassment because what sexual harassment is him walking with his ass hanging out and I can see his butt cheeks jiggling. And what do you want me to do? I get a little bit mouth watering. That is not sexual harassment. Are you serious? Sir, 
This is a public place. Down? She can't walk with his ass hanging out. Actually, sir, as long as he is not exposing his genitalia to you, he is within his rights to wear whatever the hell he wants. Is his wiener? I don't appreciate it. Well, you don't have to appreciate it. It's the law. You can even go topless here in Idaho because mammary glands are not considered sexual organs. I know. It's terrifying to you. Isn't I got to get the hell anyway. out of here. I got to get out of this state. Yes, I'm do. going back to yes, Texas. Get the. Oh, my God. Goodbye. You here. I'm giving the phone that, back to sir. the German guy. Well, hello. Well, hello. Thank you. Hello. Oh, my God. Thank you for that. You have done me so proud. I, I appreciate how much you stuck up for me. Um. Is, is, are you feeling safe at the moment? Do you need help getting into your I room? Is, are you new to the property? looks like he's going away now. His room is kind of across from mine, but he's going back. It looks like he closed the door, but I'm going back now, and I've got my, my key. But to tr- tell you the truth, the, the, it, I was very offended, and yes. you would stuck you, up for me, and I appreciate it. Would you, would, would you get into your room, please? I have a few questions to ask you I'm, before I hang up, because obviously if I'm, this is happening at our property, if this sort of harassment on our private property is happening, I do want to know so that we can consider what actions to take against him. So one second as I hop into my back end, that, that, was, that was not a butt joke, but it was pretty funny. If you take <laughs> that no, no, yeah, yeah, that is great. No, yes, I am. I'm getting. I'm just getting in the room now. But the thing was, I was like, I'm not sure. I've got to tell you whatever you want to know about him. But I was like, okay. I, I think maybe I feel guilty because I was wearing the booty shorts in the. He doesn't know the Augen, yeah. Augenbots, the yeah. German. And I was bending over, and maybe he, maybe perhaps he, maybe did see something that I did not intend. But at the same time, why was he there looking at me if he had such a problem with it? Do you know what I'm saying? I, I was just trying to insert the key. I had okay. the key in so my fanny pack, and I was pulling it which, out, and he was look. Which, yes. Which room are you in? Which room are you in? I'm not sure the the numbers. Um, English. I'm I'm very shaken up. Um, I will tell you in a um, moment. No, 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 I, okay, I'm just getting in the room and I'm name? trying to get my shoes and hey, things yeah. off. And what is your and, and what is your name, sir? I like your shorts, man. Oh, I'm he's liking knocking. Your shorts, man. He's knocking again at the door. He's speaking. Okay. Hey, man. I like your name your shorts, man. Can you tell me what no, kind sir, it is, please? What was your... it's step away my from friend? him. Yes, what was I'm, your name, sir? The door is closed, but he's just kind of shouting through the door. I'm like up against it, and it's locked, I, uh, safe, but... Step, step away from the door. I just want to know okay, what okay, your name is uh, so that I can look up his information as well and get okay, this reported to my supervisor. So that, so that he will not come in either a barricade with the ironing board. But, sure. so. I, I, what, what, what's your name? My name is Johann Schaudenberg, and so what was happening was, I'm not sure this is my name for my company booked this. I'm not sure if they put it in my name. I don't think they did, but so okay. I was getting in. I was bending over to get the key for my fanny pack, and I got it in. So he was get about to unlock the door, and his man was cat calling me. And I afraid okay. he touched me, and then you stuck up for me, and I came in. And then now he was outside the door a little. Or I may honestly, it sounded like some other man or something. He had a, another man with him in his room, but he was not out here. I was like kind of looking through a crack. Okay. But now we are here, and I'm sitting on the bed, and I'm feeling a bit better. Honestly, I okay. wish I could smoke a cigarette, but I but I know I cannot in the room. Yeah. Um. If you do, if you do need to, please feel free. To if you have a, a patio of your own, please do feel free to take a moment. You can step out there. I will let the owner know yeah. about the situation. You can Amen. smoke Amen. a cigarette on the patio. Amen. Take I will light it. No, no. Hello. Hey man, it's Hello. me. I'm the taco guy. I'm me, the taco man. I did not understand the taco. What did he say? He did taco man. 
I put, hang on, I, I brought your tacos, there's a man, he, he tell me to bring you tacos, he said he's sorry. I put the phone to the door, this says he's, the, I'm, it's apparently delivery for the tacos or something, like they ordered me food or something, like a joke. Okay. I got a okay. tacos for you, man. Here we are. Here, um, the man from here, let me bring you some tacos. How is how are um, things in uh, Salt Lake? Can you open in your mouth so I can give you the tacos? Did you say, sl- sl- did you say something like about a slut? Sl- what was yeah. that? Come Salt on, Lake. man. Salt open Lake. your mouth, man. I'm going to give you a taco, okay? Slut Lake. Salt Lake. Here, op- open your L- mouth. He's talking about the city in, the, in just Utah. What are you saying? Uh, he's saying Salt Lake or something. Yes, Salt Lake, not Sir? Salt Lake. Salt Lake. Salt Lake. I don't know yes. what you're saying. Well, what does this have to do with the, what we are doing? What is You are well, help, helping I'm, me now. You seem I'm defensive. Just, well, right now I'm actually trying to figure out if you're even staying at our property because I feel like I'm just getting... Yanked around by a couple of crank yankers. I understand. I was up to that too. You helped you, me. You let me help you. I want to be able to get I this taken care is... of for you. What? What is yes. the room number that you are in? Okay, I think I was like a, a two eighteen or something. Five hundred. Okay. Ten. I'm sorry, well, John. It's hard for me. I'm... Quit yanking my chain. Quit yanking my chain. No. I am yes, you are. Sure. I'm sorry. You are ha- Why are you being mean to me? You are helping me so much earlier. What has happened is I am here with my company. They have booked the room for me. What company are you I'm with? I'm not sure. They did not put it in my name. My yes. name is Johan Schaudenberg. But okay, you but what not company are you have with? That. Because I, I can see the reservations and, and I'm, I'm not seeing anything that I think would be you. Arsch Spritze. Excuse, excuse me. Now I recognize. It the is joke. a sanitation Please. company. No, it is a bidet sanitation. I am an engineer. I product design. So I design bidets, and that's why I'm in America. I'm trying to sell them to an American market, for they are not. It's an untapped market. Okay. You want me to explain to you the business from the Auschwitzer 5000? What I really, what I really, what I really want to guy. do is, what I really want to do is to help you to solve the issue that you're having if you're one of our guests. We do not want our guests to be harassed by other guests. Of course, that's why I, I, I want you. To help you want you, but, but. So there is no room 218. Okay, well. Let me, I, let me get out I think my the wrong place. dictionary I, in my phone. I'm sorry. I'm trying. I'm not knowing the English numbers. It's hard for me okay. because okay. German do it everything backwards. That doesn't sound like or something like, a German person would say. No, it's in numbers. We say like you say like 218, but it's like 218. We say like, or if it's like, we say we say the la, like the first number and then the last number and then the second number. Okay. So the num so it's that's the order. So it's hard so for me. Two? It's like math. Yeah, I completely understand. Eight, I struggle with math too. Thank you. So, like, whatever name there is, there must be my boss. Our American, we have an American, you know, in the office, and he will, like, I corresponded, he will, like, make appointments, or he will make other meeting times and the hotel rooms. So, whatever the name is there, I'm not sure I've never met him. I am looking through all of our reservations and I'm just not seeing anything. Okay. One second. I'm just going to well, really I'm quickly. Well, I'm trying to get in the bed and I'm trying, to, like, I've tried to slip 
Außer sie ist Booty Shorts. Five years been standing. I'm sorry, I'm so upset. I've been standing in my heels all day, and this man, he was just. You, it's been a big day, and like you're just so stuck on the room, and I'm just trying to sleep at the end of a big day because I feel like violated. But the more persistent that man got, it was it was upsetting. I hear you. So, I guess I will be down there shortly. Um, I can give you a call I will, back I will once just, I get there. Yes. I've yeah, already have, notified the or I'll leave the door open we don't, because I just don't got to get in the bath. I've got to just relax and just shave my legs and so I can't oh, I can't oh, deal. You're in, okay, you're in room four. You're in room four. Okay, gotcha. Thank oh. you so much. We don't that, that's okay. the one with the bath. That helps me a lot. Thank you. Yeah. Well, hello. Who? That's another. This um, sounds like a drunk asshole. Let me in. He's knocking on my god. Pizza, another? Man. Yeah. Honestly. Oh, honestly, pizza, sir. No? I, 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 I'm, I'm looking at that reservation, and I'm familiar with the guest who is in that room. And I just, I don't think that I, I do not think that you are being honest with me. I, I said bad. You said bad. I said a, 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 no. There's a pizza knocking on the door now. Apparently, he sent me tacos. Now he's sending me pizza. I, this is like harassment. But anyway, no. Yes. I, you said uh, if you said, if you have a problem, uh, call the fucking cops. Like, My apologies. Like, I'm bad. done with this. I can't be doing this. Well, you, just you come called up our emergency here line. I'm you worried. called our you called our emergency line. I have sent officers down. If you need to talk to them, that's Oh my fine. God! That was a man in. He was behind the shower curtain. I'm going to fuck the shit out of this man. No. No. Bend, bend over right now, man. Come on, bend oh, over. God. Oh, fuck. I, I'm i just tired at this point. Just go ahead. Fuck it. Yeah. Whatever. Hey, I'm just going to yeah. give a little fucking look at yeah. some sleep Please. at the end of the goddamn night. Yes. Please give me stop that. messing with me. Oh. Okay, okay, fuck it. I'm we keeping the pen we fanny love pack on, Zoe, motherfucker. We call, we call you because we no, love you. We want to tell you that we love you. Get Ooh. the other boys in okay. here, fuck it. We'll run train. Do you want to coming up to their room with us and having fun, please? I just shaved my Hello. legs. What a I wig you want me to put the wig on? I, I will be honest with you. I am growing frustrated with this conversation. Even though no. I do find it to be an amusing troll, I do find it to be an amusing troll. Look, just call me do back. Do not get me wrong. Isn't if, it really if, it weren't, if it weren't for if it weren't for the fact that you got me uh, woke me up out of bed with an emergency oh call my to, God, our line, so to our phone line, I would we're be so a little sorry. I would be a little bit less pissed off right now. Okay. You are sleeping on the job. Okay. I love it. Come we're up sorry. and sleep with no, me, baby. No, I am on call. Maybe you I come. Am on you call come twenty four seven. You son of a bitch. Oh, then come on oh. up. It's the best time to oh. be on call for the party. We, we do it like the you. discotheque in Deutschland, baby. Hey. We love you. Hey, hey Milkman is your cool. This reminds me of freaking... Uh, hey, hey, like, do you remember the uh, old... Do you remember the old SNL uh, skit with... Uh, we will pump you up. The uh, Hans and Franz one. Yes. That's what you guys are sounding we like. Will pump yes. you up. And, no, and, I, I and don't so have just Johan, you, you know, I have like Hans Olf. My name is Hans Olf, I'm from Switzerland. Yeah. Anyway, I really do need... Listen, dude, I just need to step away from this. Please do not call this phone number again. Hey, I can tell that hey, you're not one of you our did good. Okay, sweetie. You did good. Bless man. your heart. You did good. I love you. We appreciate you. You do a very, very good job. We appreciate you. This was the best. Okay. Oh, back home. Literally, there's yeah. better things to do on we a Friday night. You. I could under, I could no, understand if you were a couple of fifteen-year-olds. You'll never, like, whatever. It's, it's, I'm funny, man. You'll never it's get a call really like this really again, really man. Really and you'll look back on it and you'll laugh and you'll laugh. And that's what life's about, right? You can't get the good without the bad or the bad without the good. And if this he is bad right now, really it'll be shorts. good later because you'll laugh. But I can't express my annoyance at this. 
And that is 100% I know, but that's how you feel. For sure. It is. For sure. For sure. I know. Oh, it's silly. But you silly, made silly, gold but like, you're because a you're sport. a genuine person, and it was great. Yeah. And we love you. Honestly, this is probably one of like, oh, the most I love you guys so much. Had. When you Goodbye. said I Good. wear booty shorts, dude, I felt okay, okay. that. Okay, all right, all right. Let's let's dude, end this so this man can get some sleep. Like, you yeah, the best you're doing line you're on night. call all the time. You're doing good, dude. We yeah, you're keep crushing awesome. it and keep Good caring. Sweet dreams that, yeah. with your booty shorts. Somebody's Don't gonna stop need caring. That. You're amazing. We fucking love you, dude. Fucking love you, dog. You I are our love favorite you, person all night. No, but we actually do this in in honor of someone who died too, though. So it's something that they loved. So that's why they yeah tell them guys. ADK. It's like Harley No Cross. Yeah, it is. It is kind of in in memory, like. But you're a good sport about it. And sorry for waking you up. We didn't know that we would rouse you from your sleep, but you were a good sport, and you actually like cared about like you know people. And that. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The kids, there you go. Fantastic. The Madhouse Militia, yeah. That's right, where all the kids get together and have fun. Like, play well together, and all the kids play well together. Right here in our Madhouse Militia family romper room. That's right. Our Madhouse Militia family is on a journey together. Together, we can overcome all of our sitting pain and fear and anger and learning the laughing at our problems melts away the grief of our troubles. We find that our strength is the power of laughter, kindness, and joy. That's right. All of this world can't use more of that. Everybody needs that. Even though they want me. It's okay. You can admit it here, because it's a madhouse militia. That I drift is just a trip. And other alive, keeping me alive, giving me a reason to go on forward, putting a smile on my face, putting a smile on each other's face, that's right, talk about a room to be found right here, each and every week, I cannot do it without you, my dear, the love, and my brother, Axel, machine, the man connected the wheels, bearing the way to God, bless you, brother, for helping me carry this gigantic torch, Inspired by the money to the journeys of the world, the bad house, all through the cold pie. That's right, we're still spreading the word, the fucking groove of things that we've been following many years ago. We were thrown all the way in the future, we're missing but never forgotten. Always in our hearts, just we see no little bad house called the still Captain Cody the Crown. That's right, you come here every night with me in the El Marco de la Madre. Thank you so much, Axel. God bless you, brother. I also want to thank you, Mr. Mad Machines. I haven't seen him tonight, Wasted Machines. Sorry about that. I thought I Wasted Machines. But anyway, thank you so much for finding this stage with us here every week. We couldn't do it without you, brother. Thank you so much. Uh, everybody know it's. Uh, Madhouse Entertainment, family entertainment we had tomorrow. Um, Milkman, I hate to say this, but I can't hear a word you're saying over the music. The music's like coming in and out. It's been it's been poking us the whole time. I didn't want to interrupt you though. Same thing. Okay. Yeah. I wasn't Anybody? sure if it was just me. I thought it was me. I thought it was my internet connection yeah. shooting itself. Oh. Yeah, it's it's okay. drowning. Yeah, the music's drowning you out, but I think Dwight might be doing it. It's making everything go wonky, like yeah. in and out. 
<laughs> in and out. In and in out. out. In and uh, out. Uh, uh, We're inside uh, of like uh, a wawa uh, pe pedal, is what it is. That's kind of what it feels like. <laughs> That's what it sounds like. Yeah. Unintended effect. Cool. <laughs> Anybody know? Do you like doing the machine? I think he might be. I have no idea. He might be. But I don't know for a fact. But he's due to do a show because he didn't do one last week, so I assume that yes, he it's will do a show. It's been a while. Yeah. Okay. He well, there you takes go. One More Madhouse of, entertainment. He tries to take only one week off a month. I take zero weeks off. I just keep going. Yeah. All right. Milk, well, the music's still playing, by so. the way. It's very loud. Okay. I don't know if you do that. Milk All right. in and out. Yes. He's in the wall and... Uh, okay, He's so tomorrow department. night, if we do not have the D-White machine, but you could possibly expect it, stop by in D-White Court. And if not, we got plenty of entertainment provided by Cat Machine with your big screen, all you movie fans. Get on over there and take a gander at what she's got. Some entertainment provide, many hours in the camera provide every week, Saturday nights. And if you're really into the movie thing, stop in early. Get in on the voting machine. Her and Mad Hatter are holding the fork down over there for Madhouse Family Entertainment. So I want to thank each and every one of you. And the wow, 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 wow. Thank you so much for putting up with this and letting me make my horrible sounds. I, I always enjoy sounding like... <laughs> this is the Madhouse Militia Milk and the Space in the Mothership with Captain Carly Ross. <laughs> Thank you, guys. So you fixed it on that. That part was good. So it was all okay then. <laughs> Did you change anything? No. Oh, that's weird. I just didn't put my where's sound yeah. effect. That oh, was it. Okay. So maybe that was doing I don't know. What are you talking about? This is a hotel. Okay, tell him to hold your dick, motherfucker. <laughs> Mother joke. <laughs> you don't even know how to speak that asshole. <laughs> all in a grocery bag and put that grocery bag in your asshole. How about that?